Did you? I saw recently. Did you know that there is a population of macaque monkeys in Florida? There's like hundreds of them. Weren't you also the one that sent me the thing about the Nile crocodiles in Florida? Oh yeah, <laughs> I know, bro. <laughs> they have Nile crocodiles. They have macaques. <laughs> It's fucking crazy. It's introducing that's what that's what these fucking people do when they don't. That's why the was it the Burmese pythons and everything like that. Yeah, are overpopulated and taken over in Florida because of people like that, and they like reproduce at a crazy rate too. Yeah, see that's the problem that they don't see coming. Sometimes, yeah, things become super, or there's nothing to prey Invasive, on them, yeah. and they like yep. just eat everything, everything, fucking wipe out all the species. Okay, so what we know between 2009 and 2014, a handful of Nile crocodiles, three or four individuals, were confirmed by DNA to have been captured in South Florida near Miami in the Everglades National Park. These animals are thought to have been escapees or released, likely from private collections or a facility, see? not native wild arrivals. It doesn't take much. It doesn't sprinkle bro. a couple animals. Yeah. That's what happened with the macaques too. They were like somebody captured them and let a few go, <laughs> and they just turned into this massive fucking population. Now, <laughs> I bet you the the people that did that they're like, hey, it's not gonna do anything. Just just like a couple out there. <laughs> Wait, did you let a boy and a girl out? Uh, oh, I didn't think about that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now you have a mega population over there. Okay, so the main population uh, of rhesus macacus, which is the macaque monkeys, so it was in the 1930s. Um, they were introduced down there? Mm, okay, so this is wild but true. In the 1930s, a Florida tour boat operator released several macaques on an island in Silver Springs State Park to create a Tarzan tourist attraction. Oh, my <laughs> God, <people> dude. dude. <laughs> the monkeys swam off the island almost immediately. <laughs> <laughs> because because macaques are strong swimmers and spread into the surrounding forests and river systems. <laughs> the population has expanded for nearly a century. Carry diseases. This is the biggest issue. Yeah. A significant portion, 25 to 30% of Florida macaques carry herpes B virus. Herpes B is, a, is mild in monkeys, but can be fatal in hummans if transmitted through bites, scratches, or contact with body, bodily oh fluids. God. 